Right, so the next load of bollocks is called, well, it's called Tunnel Escape in the uh, actual inlay, but on the screen it is called Escape or Bust. Uh, so this looks like a version of that fucking coin op arcade game, I can't remember the name of it, uh, Super Balloon or some shit like that. I mean, by cassette 50 standards, it looks like it's had quite a bit of work done to it. So, uh, well, let's get a game underway. Yeah, I fucking hate this game. I hate the arcade original that this is a copy of. I mean, if you were in a hot air balloon and the actual balloon part was waving left to right that much, fucking yeah. What a fucking shame. So, uh, graphically, <coughs> it's... Yeah, well, graphically, certainly by uh, Cassette 50 standards, it's fucking amazing. Uh, but, uh, yeah. It's still shit, so far as... I mean, I fucking hate the... I hate the actual game that this is, you know, based on. I, I just hate the fucking movement on the balloon there. I mean, you know, hot air balloon, and it's fucking moving around like that, and then he fucked that up, and it, yeah. So the highlight of this game is the fact that uh, this is actually the last game on uh, side one so I'm actually uh, some way towards finishing going through this fucking load of shit oh, fuck. what a fucking shame um, so, I mean, with, with this game, oh uh, yeah, it definitely gets a shitometer rating, but uh, it's because I hate the, uh, the the game that, you know, the arcade coin-op that this game is based on. It's not that it's a fucking, you know, shit effort, which so much of Cassette 50 is, but... You know, it's a decent job of doing a game that I fucking detest anyway. Um, so, yeah, on the shitometer, this gets 10. Um, which makes it the second best game I've done so far on cassette 50, but that really isn't saying anything. Uh, so, uh, yeah. But that's, that's enough uh, of that. It may be the second best game so far on Cassette 50, but it's still one that I can't stand. So, uh, yeah. 10 on the shitometer. Uh, and that's side one done. So, uh, well, we'll see what joys await us on side two. I can't wait.